Yo, what's going on back on board crew? We're back for another video and this is going to be what we call a little lap session. With your little lap, I'm going to measure it at anywhere between four to eight miles. So we're putting in right here off of, uh, I really don't know. It's called like Etiquette Point now or something like that. I probably just messed the name up. But it's an old put in over here in uh, Central. We're going to put in, paddle up the river, see how far we can go. You put in on the lake and you catch the end of 12 Mile Creek right here, which we paddled before. But this is the first time we've ever been out here on a stand-up board. So let's get in the water. Back on board. Yo, Yo what's going on back on board, crew? So I'm going to give you a little bit of insight on what's going on. The GoPro actually started messing up here in a second, and this is all the footage we got from this run. It ended up being like a six mile day or something. All right, on to the next spot, back on board. Yo, what's going on back on board crew? We're back, training still. We're here at Tumbling Shoals, testing out this new board I got from one of my really good friends, because if the board feels good, I'm wanting to race it in the under 12 foot class at the White Water Center. So enough of me talking, let's go on ahead and get on the water, back on board. You. Yo, what's going on back on board crew? So if the images on Google map are correct or accurate to the water level right now, that means I just walked around this rapid right here, grueling little portage, walked around this rapid, and now I should be able to paddle as far upstream as what I feel like, because it just went on and on and on and on forever almost. So we're gonna get some grinds in today, long distance. Back on board, you explore. Yo, so what's going on back on board crew? So after the train bridge, that was the unmarked bridge on Google Earth that I was trying to figure out what in the world it was. So it looks like it's a train bridge. I really didn't follow it that much more. So here's a little rapid. So I guess I'm going ahead and turn around and call it. Need probably need to call it anyway because I'm actually working with Warhound Brian after this. So enough of me talking. Let's go on ahead and get after it and punch it back to the vehicle. Back on board. Woo!
Yo, what's going on back on board crew? We're back down here at the bottom, at the rapid. And this board was blistering fast downriver. I mean, that's what Corin built it for. He built it as a downriver race board. And even with the really short fin, boy, she flies downriver. So, everything goes the way I'm hoping. I'm gonna do that race. I, I think I'm gonna do it. But enough of me talking about that. We're gonna go on ahead and push it the rest of the way back. It only ended up being, I think, like 2.3 miles one way. So we're probably gonna be almost six miles. I mean, yeah, almost five to six miles when we get done with it. So back on board. Woo! Yo, what's going on back on board, crew? I hope y'all enjoyed this week's video. And like I said, this is the last couple training segments until the race. So next week's video is gonna be the race at the U.S. National Whitewater Center. But enough of that, I'm going to end this week's video, hit y'all with the quote, and get out of here. No dreams, no goals can be denied to the one who refuses to give up and be denied. Back on board. You.